The Federal Environmental Protection Agency awarded grant money to nearly 150 communities across the country. Four recipients in Georgia and Perry was one of them. Zach Merchant tells us how the city plans to use that money. Many of downtown Perry's shop fronts are full, and Assistant City Manager Robert Smith says that's indicative of positive trends throughout the city. Yeah, uh, very healthy. But some properties are lagging behind. Like this one. Smith says Blue Jay Meatpackers has stood empty for decades, but he's hoping some new grant money from the EPA might change that. We're looking at properties that had uses in the past that might be associated with um, contamination or environmental issues. So far, the city's identified several sites, including a vacant pier station on Main Street, an empty dry cleaners at the Eastgate Plaza, a lumber mill on General Courtney Hodges Boulevard, and the meat packing facility that sat empty for years, according to neighbor Robert Russell. As long as I can remember, I've been here for 35 years. I don't remember when it was open. Smith says he thinks concern about pollution might have kept buyers from purchasing the vacant properties and making them productive again. But he says the city's now secured a $300,000 grant from the Environmental Protection Agency to determine whether the sites are actually polluted, something Russell is all for. I think it's great. I think a lot of this stuff needs to be cleaned up. If pollution is discovered, Smith says the city will work to clean it, likely with funding from further grants. And in the end, he hopes the project helps revitalize these empty sites. You know, just bring in some of these properties that have been sitting there, that have been stagnant, bring them back online, um, you know, turn them into something. Smith expects the testing to begin this summer. And Perry Zach Merchant, 13 WMEZ News. Smith also noted that the grant is for a three-year period. He says the process could take less time depending on how willing site owners are to let assessors onto their properties and how much, if any, pollution is discovered.